Hey there folks, this is GreenyXI, welcome you right back to Let's Play Earthbound, this is episode 12. What we're going to do today is check around Saturn Valley and see what's going on. Once upon a time, we were many, many, every day, slowly, are less, less. Ah, oh, they're dying off. Oop, might as well check this out. Rust promoter, we could have bought those back in Sweden, can we, but I, I don't know what they do. Dip, there we go. <laughs> Oh, lots of rubbish. Hmm, protractor, I don't want a protractor anyway. I don't really know what they do, but they can't be that good. I don't know what to do. We got too much stuff, which is something I never thought I'd say about this game. Copper base, like we'll never need that. We could sell it, but money ain't a problem for us right now, so here's. Uh, what else? So many heal night guns, but I think that's a good thing. Go to bottle rockets, which is probably a good thing as well. Get rid of the toy a gun. That'll give us room to get these two items now. Broken spray can. Probably be something good once we rest and wake up with it. Sudden get spill. Is that a permanent increase or is it just like a temporary one in battle? Doubles the gets during battle. Ooh, I can't see myself using it, see? So let's give it a to make a bit of room. Uh... Oh, another cave. <laughs> okay, there's plenty of caves around here. Hello. We look like same. I give you some th special thing. Not now, Zoom. I give you on the way back. Okay, go remember to talk to him. Base behind Grapefruit Falls. Belch man say, say password. Okay, so we're going to be asked for a password. Then we've got to stand still for three minutes. Oh, that should be exciting. <laughs> I'll try and remember. What? What are you talking about, you weirdos? I, I don't follow you. Strap <laughs> you. Such a big place. Wow. Oh, it's a shop. Okay. So let's try and sell off a couple of things because, you know, I don't, I don't think we need quite as much as we got. I'm gonna make a bit of room. I am gonna get rid of a bottle rocket or two, just because I think we've got too many now, which is strange. What can we buy? Nothing much good. What's a picture postcard? It's only two dollars, but I imagine it might be something pretty shite. Like a protractor or something for that small amount of price. Yeah, oh, not no. Sell some stuff. Properly this time. So many items that could be proper items, if you know what I mean. Proper useful items. Um, Get rid of the bread roll, because I don't think that's very useful anymore by this point. Let's start buying. I want to see where he's going anyway. Bionic slingshot. I don't want a slingshot. Do I? I've been told by people not to get the slingshots, because they make you miss a lot more. So I'm not going to do that. Silver bracelets. We'll get two of them, once I have the money. Charm, I guess we'll get two of them. We're going to be using a lot of money at this place. Aren't we? Red ribbon, we'll get on now. Five more defense, really good. Get rid of the ribbon. Yeah. Going to take 1,500 out. Oh, is that enough? I, we still have loads of money left over, so why not? Put 
Bola can have a slingshot as well, can she? I thought it was on your nest. This, this inventory system is annoying. In my RPGs, I like to have infinite inventory, or, you know, seemingly infinite. That's not what we're getting in this game. It's annoying. Yeah, whatever, just sell it. Yeah. Oh, so much. There's so much. Buy. Last thing I'm going to buy now is a great charm for Ness, but he hasn't got room, so we're going to have to give that to, say, Paula for now. No, don't worry about this equipment, she's got it anyway. Uh, this is hard work. This, we'll drop this. I know we could sell it, but oh my god, I can't be asked. Give the great charm over to Ness. We'll equip it. Barely anything better, considering how much we pay for it, but why not? And the sell off. It's so hot and boiling hot, and that's probably what you can hear in my commentary. <laughs> but there we go. What's it do? I can't find it. <laughs> Might be being stupid. Travel charm, here we go. I was being stupid, funnily enough. No, I'll do. Let's go. Yay, it's that leveled up. Uh, everything's going up by one. Not a brilliant level up, but... Okay, okay -ish. I've come all the way back here. Because there's nothing left to do in the town. There's all dead ends and everything, so... I came back. Speaking of, somebody mentioned the waterfall. I'm waiting three minutes when we got a password, so... Yay, Paula's leveling up. Uh, not much to go on, but yeah, so I thought I'd come back here because this seemed like a good waterfall-ish area. And here's a waterfall. Oh! Oh, have we got a fuzzy pibble- Pibbles? A fuzzy pickles moment we have. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Ready, say, fuzzy pickles! in. Oh, say the password. Okay, now we got to wait three minutes, and we, they said, so I'll see you again in three minutes' time. Okay, that was quite possibly the longest three minutes of my life. <laughs> Let's get going. Oh my god, there's going to be another dungeon. Okay, well, let's get exploring then. Hello, you. Did you bring some fly honey? It's Master Belch's favourite. Yep, we did. We were told about this by the last boss in, in 3, or under 3. Okay. Bye, sir. Oh. These look like new enemies. So let's just... Let's just do physical attacks. Bye, Foppy. They are really easy to kill. Maybe they do a lot of damage, but they don't take much. Nest level is now 27. A lot more HP, good. Hypnosis... Omega? I think that's the Omega symbol. Yeah, I think so. <gasps> Four zombies in, this in our battle, but it didn't seem... It wasn't as bad as I thought it would be, to be honest. A bomb? Okay, that could be handy, I guess. Oh! Oh! I gotta give it to his arc, he's starting to do a ton of damage with his attacks. Oh, <laughs> that was a shit level up. Another battle? I guess we might as well try the lad route. <laughs> Why not? Um, 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 um. Okay, a door. That could be good. Could mean that we've come the wrong way. Polo's now level 23. 
HP by 2, PV by 2, okay. Paula keeps catching colds from these zombies and it's getting really annoying. <laughs> Just, let's sort that out, shall we? As well as I want to heal up a tiny bit. Ness is actually still quite high on health, but at the same time, for him, it's quite, it was quite low. Right, the babies. That's what I came here for. <laughs> By the looks of it. IQ capsule. Broken laser. Okay, that might be even better than the laser gun that's gone right now. Increase your IQ when taken. See. I need more room. Come on you, you don't need all this crap, you. Let's drop that. And now... Give that to... Zack. And use it. Ah, oh, we could just use it like this. Bugger. Oh well. Let's carry on with this place, shall we? Frame rate. Why is this happening? Yep, it's hard to make those sounds that Master Belch does. I know I can't do it. Oh. Gigas. I've heard that name before. Let's keep going. Oh, at, least, at least we're leveling up pretty quick around here. Know that we did in that battle, but. You know, in general. Ooh, so you're the ones who destroyed the zombies that I assigned to Threed. Oh shit. Is this supposed to be a hard battle? Nope. <laughs> no, it's not. That's really easy. Considering they had a bit of dialogue, I thought it would have been a mini boss or something, but no. Okay, a couple of items around here then. Hello, step. Mm. Oh, okay. Vital capsule. HP sucker. Screw the HP sucker. I can't be bothered with sorting items out now. It's too much in this game. That's the one issue I'm having with it. The one main issue. Can't even remember what Vitality does. It's just HP. Give it to Paula anyway. Okay, good. No! Is Axe level 23? Offense by 2? Nice, actually. Bit more strength. I call it strength just because that's what it's like in other RPGs, isn't it? Yay, Ness leveled up. Offense by 4! Jesus! Guts by 3? Luck by 3? Amazing. Amazing level up. And we cover some health. At least I've stopped crying now. That seems to go away when you finish a battle. So good, good. Let's try this way. Polo's level is now 24. Offense by 3. Okay. That's not. Ooh, ooh, that's exactly what I wanted to happen for my health. Magnet Omega. I don't even use Magnet, but maybe it's something good. But I don't know. We're starting to get low on PP now, so I'm going to avoid any unnecessary doors. I like how these slimy little pile enemies are basically just a pile of shit. <laughs> Literally. We're supposed to be in some like sewers or something. It doesn't look like it, but... Let's go in. Oh! Doesn't mean I don't trust you, just say it. Say it now. Something so quiet is either extremely shy or extremely dangerous. What suspicious fellow? I thought we were going to need a password then. That would have been horrible. <laughs> no idea. No idea, sir. Oh, he looks like a boss if I ever saw one. Health seems fine, PP is going to be a bit of trouble. <laughs> see you in S? I see. Yuck, yuck, yuck. It's prophecy that the boy will destroy Master Gygas. Who the hell's Master Gygas anyway? You make me laugh so hard. If Master Gygas is scared of someone, he would have to be worse than the greatest evil. Mm, I'll take you down big time, so get ready for the worst fight of your life. I can imagine the nausea coming when, when I'm against something like this. 
That was pretty disgusting, I'll be honest. Okay, we're delivering your jar of fly honey, sir. Defend, I guess. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I quite like that. I'm gonna keep his PP for healing now, I think. And she... I think freeze, sounds about right. And a bottle rocket, considering we've got a couple of empties to spare. Ooh, that was a lot of damage. And we'll do it again, considering it did so much. And then you use another bottle rocket. How are we starting to run low? I shouldn't have thrown away a couple, should I? That was simple. The bosses lately have been pretty easy. It's been figuring out what to do next has been the hard part. Up by one, hit me by one. Ooh, Thunder Beater. I don't use Thunder, actually. I don't know why. That was a good level up. I'm still going. <laughs> Looks like it was an even fight. People have been telling me that that is supposed to be a hard battle. I, I don't understand. The city will soon be in worse condition than living in your own puke. <laughs> Ew. Ew. Let's go. Ah, Mr. Saturn. I escaped. Doing booty. Yep. Are they supposed to be like little aliens? I don't know. Did you escape too? <laughs> P.U. We stink after being spewed on by that. Oh, we're out. Okay, can I go in? Can I go in, please? Yeah, I would, but... How do I go in? Oh my god, another photo man. Pictures taken instantaneously. I know, I know. I'm starting to get used to this whole thing. Fezzy pickles. Thank you. I still love the music around here, by the way. It's great. Whole milky well. I guess we'll be going in there sometime. Yeah, okay. Oh, oh my. <laughs> what are we doing now? <laughs> You've travelled very far from home. I think we have... Go. Do you think we're fine to the game? I mean, there's plenty more of those guardians, apparently, to take on, but... I think we're doing pretty well. We're on level 20-odd already. Do you remember how your long and winding journey began with someone pounding at your door? It was Pokey, the worst person in your neighbourhood, who knocked on the door that faithful night. On your way, you have walked, thought and fought. Yet through all this, you have never lost your courage. You've grown steadily stronger. Though you have experienced the pain of battle many times. We have. It has been painful. You've even died sometimes. You are no longer alone in your adventure. Paula, who is steadfast, kind and even pretty, is always at your side. Isaac is with you as well. Though he is timid, he came from a distant land to help you. Ness, as you certainly know by now, you are not a regular young man. You have an awesome destiny to fulfill. This is quite random, I have to say. The journey from this point will be long and it will be more difficult than anything you have undergone to this point. I, I found it pretty hard already, except for the last couple of bosses. Yet I know you will be alright. When good battles evil, which side do you believe wins? Do you have faith that good is triumphant? Hmm. It should be. 
one thing you must never lose is courage. If you believe in the goal you are striving for, you will be courageous. There are many difficult times ahead, but you must keep your sense of humour. Work through the tough situations and enjoy yourself. When you have finished this cup of coffee, your adventure will begin again. Next, you must pass through a vast desert. Oh, I knew there was a desert coming here, deserts and games. And proceed to the big city of Foresight. Are we done with three? Okay. Good. <laughs> I'll be honest. I didn't like three as much as I liked the first two times. Ness. Paula. Isaac. Yes. I wish you luck. Who's talking to us? No idea. <laughs> is it just the coffee? Is the coffee talking to us? Wow, this is going to be a long damn episode. Okay, that seems like the end of it. Oh, don't tell me he's still screwed up. I used the wrong one. Never mind. This has been Greeny XI. I hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you again next time when I'll be fully healed up and I'm going to sell a couple of things at the drugstore, I think, just to sort things out. I'll see you again in a bit, folks.